Hey everyone, uh, I just wanted to do a quick uh, product review on one of the products that we sell here at the, the Plant Guide Auto Road. It's called the Water Plant CO2 Indicator. Um, it's basically, uh, if you can't uh, afford a, a normal pH uh, meter or a pH controller, uh, this is a very good option to uh, sort of uh, keep an eye on, on, on the CO2 levels in your tank. Uh, it's very similar to um, ones that you can normally see on eBay, the glass ones. Uh, the reason I like this one is it's a lot easier to use uh, for a couple of reasons. And I'll show you the, uh, the different components here. This is, the thing I like about this one is, it, is that it actually comes apart. So you can take this part off. It's easy to get the liquid out of it, easy to clean it if, you, you know, if there's stuff built up in it. Same thing with this. And, uh, and it's a lot easier to use, which I'll show you in one second here. So basically this just goes on top here like this. And in a second, basically the, the CO2 indicator fluid just goes in the top here. Uh, you don't need to use any, any, wa any uh, water, which is something you have to do with the other sort of glass ones is you have to use a 4 dkh uh, solution of water which can can be kind of hard to find or make yourself and then you just add a few drops of the solution into that whereas this one doesn't use any water it just uses the solution itself so I'll, I'll get this filled up and show you what it looks like so here it is you just simply fill uh, uh, fill, fill the reservoir with the indicator fluid and, and uh, put the rubber thing back on here and uh, as you can see, we've got a, a solution that looks fairly blue, which, as you know from any sort of pH testing, it uh, would indicate a pH of around 7 or so. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this on my nano tank uh, that has CO2 running, and we'll take a look at it then. Okay, so here it is. It's in a, uh, an ADA tank, a little 5-gallon uh, ADA tank, and we're running uh, about a bubble per second of CO2. So uh, we'll we'll come back in a little bit and see uh, and see what uh, color it changes to. So so here we are about half an hour or so later, and you can see the indicator uh, color is is uh, a very light green, almost a yellowish, which would indicate a very low pH, probably in the 6.5 or even 6.4 range. Um, Again, it's not totally accurate if you need it really accurate, if you need it at 6.7, 6.8, 6.9, whatever, get yourself a <coughs> pH monitor. Um, but I mean, this is just good enough for the, you know, do-it-yourself CO2 setup, small tanks, that sort of thing. Uh, just, to give you, just to give you an idea if your CO2 is even working or not. You know, I've, I've had lots of calls from people who, who are doing CO2 and they actually have no clue whether or not uh, it's even working. Um, so this is an option. It's eleven ninety nine on the site. Um, I don't have any in actually right now, but should have some in very shortly. Uh, it's a really good buy. If you have any questions on it, just uh, fire me an email or just leave a comment. Thanks.